Hey Leute, und weiter geht's mit Teil 2. Ich hoffe, Teil 1 hat euch gefallen gestern. Auch wenn die Bildqualität nicht so besonders ist. Aber wie gesagt, ich arbeite dran. Es wird immer besser, versprochen. Viel Spaß! Had you. Damn it, Cam. I told you to stay at the house. How suspicious do you think this looks now? Two cars parked up near the police station? Stop treating me like a kid. Now, where's the truck? Over there, near the entrance. Well, there's no way in there. So let me show you how the 21st century will solve this. A truck that size is bound to have a cargo manifest. If I can hack it, I might be able to find out what it was hauling. Okay, maybe it was good you tagged along after all. Oh, so now you're fine with technology? Okay, I just need to lock on to its signal. Almost there. Okay, no manifest, but it's got a satellite navigation system. Maybe I can find out where it's been previously. Right, let's see where these guys have been. Okay, there are six locations on their recent stops list. You take three, I'll take the other three. Sure, text them to me. If anything looks promising on this Kai journey, I'll give you a call. Got it. Is it wrong that I'm excited about this? Yes, it is. You scare me sometimes. Okay, first seems to be heading east out of the city. In one mile, take the next exit onto Carre de la Selva de Mar. Take the exit. At the roundabout, take the fourth exit onto Avenue de Duarte Maristán. In 100 yards, turn right, turn right. Turn right and the destination is on your left. The gas station from the street race last night. I wouldn't be surprised if the Tadakul cool owned this whole area. Still, though, they probably just used it to fuel the truck up. It's not a delivery point. Next destination, then. Turn right. Exit onto Carre Tiffany. At the roundabout, take the motorway B10 on run. Continue on motorway B10 for two miles. All units advised. Officers attempting to stop a reckless driver. All available units are cleared of no priority calls. Stand by. Take the exit. Turn right. Officers attempting to stop a reckless driver. All available units are cleared of no priority calls. 
Second exit onto Carré del Zabras, and the destination is on your right. Moroccan restaurant. No doubt they probably hang out there, but it doesn't have a loading area. No way they're shifting their haul out on the main road. Maybe it's the next place. Turn right. In 300 yards, turn right. Turn right. Officers attempting to At stop the T-Junction, turn right into the Roman Passage. At the roundabout, take the third exit. In 100 yards. In 500 yards, take the motorway B-10 on run. Hey V, I'm at the third location, which looks like some kind of factory. Can you get a closer look? There's an insane amount of security around this place. I'd say it's a fairly good bet this is where they either pick up or drop off. Okay. Any of those other addresses work out for you? No, but you'll never guess what I'm following right now. I don't know, rainbow with a pot of gold at the end? If so, that would be perfect right now. Ha ha, no. One of those same trucks from the impound. It's driving pretty slow, so it must be full. Okay, tail it. I'll circle back and take a look at one of the other destinations I found. It's a restaurant. And if I know one thing from watching gangster movies, it's that bad guys love a good restaurant. Okay, stay safe. Always am, V. I got this. Meet you back home.
like this is the place. I can't get too close. Meet you back at the house. So what do you think those trucks are hauling, eh? Rubies, bearer bonds, the lost Wu-Tang album. Who cares? We know whatever's inside is valuable, and we know the truck's route now. So? If the answer were any more obvious, it would be breakdancing on your face. Wait, you want us to hijack one of their trucks? No way. V, listen. Let me lay it out for you. One, we're not criminals. Two, you're talking about stealing from a well-funded, highly organized criminal organization that's been doing this for like a billion years. Three, if we fail, they most certainly will kill us. Can I lay it back out for you? One, they're not going to kill us because two, we aren't professionals. And for that reason, three, they'll never see us coming. I actually followed that. What? They're right. The Tadakul is prepared to defend itself against tough rival gangs, not three amateurs. Oh, you're really selling this, Sebastian. Don't you see? That's our advantage. We hit them in transit, we steal their booty, and we're out. You two have lost your minds. V, you know we can do this. As much as I hate to agree with Cam, <laughs> I think we can pull this off. Well, I don't. Not without some help. Miss Ortiz, I was there at Race Wars when you took on that Audi. It was something to behold. Thanks. And Letty's fine. Letty and I have a mutual friend back in Miami. If we're gonna rob the Tadako, we're gonna need some rides that can't be traced. Cops are paid off by the time. So they're dirty then. I presume we can get rid of them. By any means necessary. Okay, split up. Let's make this a little more interesting for them. These guys mean business. Barcelona PD needs to up their game. Out of the car. 
me to stop and pull over? and keep the car steady. Looks like they've got backup. We'll keep them occupied. I'll get you close. Keep it steady. Right, we can 
can do this. Sebastian's still pinned down. here to finish the job. Get to the cab! You set us up, Mauricio! I don't think he's in the mood to talk, Me. Watch out, they're throwing Molotovs! I've encountered punks like this before. They all end up in the same place. Getting me behind the wheel. That is grabbing my arm. That is for attacking Sebastian. That is for being a general slime ball. Who's the king now, Mauricio? Sebastian, you're clear. Go, go, go. Whoa, who's this guy? All right, work together to get this last guy. We got this. He did it! We've got the truck! Your boy's got some skills, but we still have that Mercedes to deal with. Watch out, he's dropping spikes. Ah! I'm so sorry I pushed you into this. You didn't push anyone? No. I pushed. I have a habit of doing that. Cam, honey, this is all on me. They put you in cuffs? You set us up! Where are we? Now wait a second. Did you cut a deal with Interpol? Are you their informant now? I am never forgiving you for this. You done? Look, we're helping Interpol with a case. Just like you, they're after Kai and his organization. And was killing Sebastian part of the master plan? We were trying to save him, just like you. Who is we? Dominic Toretto? Hold on, the two of you are working for Interpol? How is this even possible? 
We're doing someone a favor. A favor? For who? Nobody you'd know. We believe the Tadakul are a supply chain for a larger criminal network. What'd you think? You were ripping off a truckload of VCRs? Okay, we get that they're super scary. So why did you help us rob them then? We wanted to force Kai to show himself. You gave us a way to do that without arousing suspicion. You're kind of amateurs to him. Rude. No, she's right. Kai, the man in the Mercedes. We were just mosquitoes he was swatting away. Kai likes to keep his foot soldiers close and his enemies closer. You want revenge. We want justice. Interpol wants information. What do you expect us to do? Make a decision. Do you want to stay amateurs or take this to the next level? This is all Interpol can afford? I'm getting tetanus just looking at this place. We're in the middle of a Moroccan desert. Not many five-star accommodations around. Wait, we're in Morocco? Please tell me you know where Kai is hiding. Mm, not exactly. He's been on the run since Barcelona. We detected him in her food, but after that, his trail went cold. So he could be anywhere? He still needs supplies and a way to communicate. Our drones have been getting shot down whenever they go near this. A data center we know has links to his organization. Aw, he's camera shy. There's no way to hack it from the outside. That's why you two are going inside. Us? Drive in, hack the server, get out. This sounds awesome. This sounds insane. Interpol will set you up with fake backgrounds strong enough to pass security. You're also gonna have to learn that ancient, beautiful language called Arabic. <laughs> Been working on these for a while now. Two desert machines built from the same parent chassis. Sort of like siblings. Well, the Moonshine Racer has my name written all over it. Uh, no. You'll be driving that. Seriously? It's garbage. Doesn't get any more anonymous than a van. At least you finally got out of Barcelona and into the burning desert inside a crap-ass rust bucket. What do you think, Dom? Are we ready to pull this off? If I didn't believe you could do it, I wouldn't have asked. What are we doing, V? We're thousands of miles from home. Sebastian's dead. We're chasing after the leader of an international crime syndicate. We're in way over our heads. I know. Wish I could turn back time on all of this. I still can't believe Sebastian's gone. Did you seriously not know about his bad guy intel services? You saw what he was like when we first arrived? He hooked us up, got us a great deal on the house. Everyone in Barcelona knew him. He was the nicest guy. He knew everyone from making bad business decisions. And what, he deserved to die for that? Damn, V. No, that's not what I'm saying. I just... I just hate it that we're not behind the wheel of our own lives, you know? Yeah. Fire confidence. What's wrong? A bridge with a canyon way below us. Come take a look. We got this. Just go slow. Please, that's all this thing can do anyway. Man, look at this. And I just realized you called Barcelona home. What? No, I gotcha. I knew you'd come around eventually. <laughs> we grew up in Miami. Barcelona was limbo. Wow. Talking makes you feel better than keep doing it, but I don't have to listen. Maybe we should just focus on the job. You ever stop 
to think about how weird this is? Which part? Driving across the desert to infiltrate a super criminal secret data layer, or...? No, the Dom and Letty thing. When we were running the street races, we were doing all we could to avoid the cops. Crazy to think that they're now working with them. When I met Letty back in LA, it was all pretty vague that her street racing days were maybe over. Rumors are that Dom went to jail in Lompoc. But then I also heard they turned up at a street race in London. And now they're working with Interpol. Put it all together and I think they put a deal, presumably with the guy they're doing a favor for. That's a pretty sweet deal. Really? You do the same? Traveling around the world taking down bad guys? I'm sure beats sitting in a garage praying for an accident. Always the rebel. Just waiting for a cause. There's the van we should be replacing. We gotta disable it before it gets to the data center. Hold tight, this might get a little rough. Hurl. Sorry, I'm trying to keep it steady. The suspension's pretty much non-existent on this thing. And these roads are like a minefield. Just get us there in one piece. I don't want to even look at the drop down, despite the view. So good, I haven't been alerted. Oh, geez, something stinks in here. Like someone stuffed a corpse in one of the side panels. Ew. Close. Get ready. I sure hope Interpol knows how to make a good fake ID. I'm more worried about my Arabic. I know I said I didn't want to die in Barcelona, but I don't want to die out here in the wasteland either. Cam. Sorry. Okay, drive steady. First sign of trouble and we turn this thing around and head back to Dom. Heck, 
Good to see a sister in charge for once. So they're progressive criminals. I feel so much better. Okay, this is your stop. There don't seem to be any cameras here, so jump out as I pass the back of the building and then get out of sight. Got it. in. Be careful. Careful is my middle name. Handful is your middle name. That was to serve. Let me know when you finish the hack. I've got to go deliver this fake package, but I'll swing around and pick you up. Um, Heck, Jaubini. Hello, Dragon Pleta. Fucker, I know Mushkila. Heck, oh, and and uh, Shukra. Wish they told me more damn Arabic than here you go at shop three. We're gonna have to figure out another place to meet. I think my cover's blown and I can't make it back the way I came. What? I'm gonna circle around the perimeter and try to get you out that way. How's the download? I'm done. Okay, I'll figure something out. Cam, they know we're here. Get out of there now. Already on it! Oh, hell yes! Now this is a van. Oh, crap. Company! What are you doing? They aren't after me, so you gotta be doing a hell of a job distracting them. Oh, I'm distracting the shit out of them right now. Just get to safety, I'll meet you back at the tetanus incubator. Ugh, this is like a cornfield. There's gotta be a way out of here. Out of my way! You're not gonna corner me that easy.
got to be at least a foot thick. Car, armored with reinforced chassis and roll bar. Oh, the hell with it. Here goes nothing! So, das war's dann für heute. Ich hoffe, das Video hat euch gefallen. Wenn ja, lasst mir gerne ein Abo da. Wenn nicht, lasst mir trotzdem ein Abo da. <lacht> Und falls ihr mich finanziell unterstützen wollt, findet ihr dazu einen Link in der Videobeschreibung. Ich sag schon mal Dankeschön und einen schönen Tag noch.